Okay. I gotta be honest with all of you guys. Be really, really clear. Toast ain't gonna do the show off the special D card because he's not gonna do the fucking Battle Tower again. But what I am gonna do is show off some of those special cards that you might not have seen during the main story. I think that's your friend, right, Steel Slash? Well, let's start with someone that we can go to. So, I'll show you the, what these things look like. Yep, there's Leon. My, my card right there. My current character. Hop, I'm going to give you a closer look of these characters so you know them. Milo, Nessa, Boo. The D, Chairman Rose, fucking bastard. Here is Clara. So let's do her. So this is her picture. And let's read her description. Clara was originally an underground pop singer. She promoted herself as a star that had both cuteness and a virulence of poison. She energetically held live concerts and other events even selling some Clara-themed collectibles that she made herself. But in spite of everything, she only managed to sell eight copies of her debut album, Crazy for Clara. She decided becoming a gym leader would help her gain more popularity and has been working toward that goal since. She chose the poison type because it matched her image and there was less competition. That makes sense. Here we got Bay or B. Sting like a B. I get it. This is her picture. And this is what it says with her. Given special attention from her parents, B trained hard with her partner Pokemon since a very young age. This has honed her judgment skills, and she is able to remain calm and collected even when facing dire situations in battle. This leads many to think she lacks emotion. And the truth seems to be that she doesn't want to show weakness. She is sometimes known to show her true feelings to her partner Pokemon during battles. She is secretly a huge fan of various sweets, and this has recently been found out by her fans. The additional attention has made enjoying sweets a little difficult. That makes sense. We got old Paul, Raihan, Marty. Alright, there's Gordy. You can see here in this picture. And his leak card. Gordy is a young rising star that many suspect will be a champion someday. Though rock type Pokemon are typically known for being rough and unrelenting, Gordy has worked hard to achieve victory through a refined and graceful battle style. He always tries to keep his fans happy and thus is very popular among the audience. On the other hand, he has the surprising tendency of shutting himself away in the locker room when he is defeated, making post-defeat interviews a rarity. This doesn't bother most of his fans, though, and they see this behavior as endearing. Oh, those poor bastards. Here we got Mustard again. You know, he was uh, the strongest, one of the strongest champions for 18 years. His intense drive. And he made the Isle of Armor. See these special cards again. Just take a closer look with them. So I probably didn't in the last parts. And here's B's. So, here we go. And we flip this over. In order to become strong, one must face opponents who are stronger than oneself. Even if defeat seems inevitable, B will still go all out and try to at least draw. It's possible that the strict, one might even say too strict, training from her stern parents has left a burden on young B, taking away her smile. 
So who has seen Beast smile? Her family? Her Pokemon? Or maybe someone else entirely? Hmm. Who really knows? And here's Gordy. Special one of Gordy with his hair down, which... Hmm. Interesting. Gordy is one of the top trainers of the Galar region, both in terms of popularity and skill. His strict training style means that his gym has few gym trainers, but he does have quite a fan base. Gordy does his best to make sure his fans are happy, often seen giving out autographs or hosting events. There are currently three photo albums of Gordy, all published through the support of his fan base. This card shows another special photo, taken specifically for this purpose at the photo studio. Makes sense. Just to see another version of... Uh, Mustard. A fairy type gym leader. And went on to become champion. Lost, until he lost his partner Pokemon after this. He lost his partner mount. Who was his partner Pokemon? Who knows? So here's a special version with Clara. So you see her here with uh, training with her uh, Slowpoke, and you see her in workout uniforms working out to become stronger. So here's this, and we look at this. The training at the Poison Type Gym was a lot harsher than Clara was ready for, and she gave up after two days. It was during this time she saw an ad for the Master Dojo during a late night TV show. The master seemed kind, and Clara thought it would help her become strong without having to try too hard. So she immediately called in to apply. Normally, Clara's sole focus is to dote on, be dote on by others. So she puts only a bare minimum into her training. But recently, a new student at the dojo has caused a change of attitude. She now works secretly with her slow bro to better herself. Peony. See a special card Peony? I might have never shown this, but I think this is a regular one. Yeah, I made this. Size Peony's card. The special one to him with his wife. I think I showed that. But I don't think we went over this a lot when we uh, did do his shield let's play with Peony. But I'm going to say right now, yes. If you probably didn't notice why people saying... That scientist said he looked a lot similar to uh, Mr. Rose. Mr. Chairman Rose. Because he is Chairman Rose's brother. He's Chairman mm -hmm. Rose's younger brother. Younger brother. So a long time ago, you know, after Mustard got retired, there were two competitors to go up against for the champions. He was the first champion before and, he won. Which was Peony and his brother. They had to fight in the league. Peony didn't care. He lost. No, he actually, I think, because no, once his brother became chairman, he left. Yeah. He was like, because he was the champion. Peony was the champion. He's technically the third champion ever known in Galar, but he yeah. left. But he left, yeah. Saying, I'm not working under my brother. And then Leon Fuck is fuck the this fourth, shit. and we're the fifth. And so, Leon eventually did fill in the but shoes. Here's but here's the question, who was the first? I believe it was Opal. Oh, that makes sense. Was saying like, oh, Mustard defeated a fairy type gym leader to become the champion. Yeah, that's all. So Opal might have been the champion at one point, which would have made more sense. Which made a lot of sense, yeah. Or was somebody else that we know? It might have been Opal's of. master because they did briefly mention that somebody trained Opal before. Right, and that she could the fairy type. That could have been the very first gym leader. Yeah, for the fairy type. Which would have made more sense. All right. Next video, boys, we're going to go back to my game, and I know I'm going to make you all cry. The finale. See you guys later. Peace.